demons. Why have you let me be? Why have you refused to let me sleep? It is unfair. Why at the day you thought I was helpless? Now I pay you back. Not even the Creator can appeal to me on your behalf. You must all learn to take care of the children so they would become pain in your lives later. Leave me alone and let me sleep. Don't leave me alone. Take it easy, yeah. Take it easy. Oh. My head. Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Maybe we should take him to the campus oh. clinic again. But we've been there four times already. Oh. First thing tomorrow morning, we're taking him home so they can take him to his family hospital. Judy, you're going to be I don't understand all this nonsense at all. You're going to be all right, eh? Chief, there is nothing to worry about. It's on very comprehensive test and the results are quite okay. And there is really nothing to worry about. <laughs> Maybe it's a pressure school. School? School never gives him pressure. He enjoys school. <laughs> he went into university rather young. It will suddenly be a different ball game. I mean, for a boy who comes from a background where everything is uh, organized, is easy and classy, I mean, a campus life in our university these days can put a lot of pressure on kids like Chidi. I'm sure this is just a face. You'll get a right, you'll see. Doctor, are you sure it is not necessary for us to fly him abroad for further check on? <laughs> Chidi. What can I tell you now? This is one of the best equipped hospitals in this country. Well, anyway, if you really feel like taking him, I'll give him a reference. But I can assure you that uh, whatever we have done here is exactly what they would do over there. But here we have, a, we have an edge. We can diagnose tropical medical matters better. From the results of uh, the test we've done so far, he doesn't even need to be admitted. Ah. Chief, 
Can you? No. I did. No. What is wrong here? I see. I see. See me. See my children as you come. He's very ill. And all the hospitals say there's nothing wrong with him. Oh my God. I see. See me. See what children has become. There's no way we ever taken this boy to. And they say they don't see anything wrong with him. They came down from England yesterday. And all the hospital says they don't know with GD. Sometimes he loses weight. Sometimes he's swelling up. And they're telling me nothing is wrong with my boy. There is no kind of test this boy has not gone through. They say it's a phase. It's a phase, it's a phase. I have not seen the kind of phase that would make a child go out of school for more than a semester. I mean, we were young too. I never saw anybody who this kind of phase moved out of, out of school for, for, for this long. Hmm? I cannot concentrate on my business. I cannot focus on my politics. And his mother's business is also suffering. What have you done? Oh my God, Chidi. All the hospitals insisted on doing its test and they all pronounced him clean. And he too, he said he has never slept with, you, with, with any girl. Well, there he is. Chief, this is not a matter of AIDS test though. My God, Chidi. No. Now you are beginning to frighten us. If there is something you are saying, eh? tell us now. GD has offended at an unimaginable level. What? GD! Who has this woman offended? Let me pity us! What have you done? I didn't do anything. GD! Good. No. Please. Hmm? You are the one that has uh, the gift in all these matters. If there is something you are seeing, uh, Iku, tell us. Well, tell us so that we will know what to do. Chief, if I say it before him, this boy will drop dead instantly. Ah! 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 And so will I. He is expected to confess by himself. Didi, you go. Didi, don't do this to us. Please. Tell us whatever it is you might have done. So that we can find a solution. Didi. Because. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Ah, this is not, this is not a deal. Okay? You had better start telling me what you did before I descend upon you. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Uh, so you are telling me now that your auntie is lying? <laughs> hmm? I don't know what she's talking about. Uh, Mirana, come back here! Where do you think you're going? I'm going to the loo. To the loo? I have told you there is no loo in this house. Toilets! I have toilets in this house. Good. Where am I supposed to have that kind of time? Huh? What are these people turning our universities into these days? Huh? Can you imagine it? Situation where parents now have to go to universities to, to sign uh, 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 personal guarantee forms for their children. Mm -hmm. Our institution of our enemy. That is Unilac, oh? Yes, it's Unilac. Can you imagine that? No. Go to BC now. Okay, we'll wave that. What do you mean? Blow up from the Yes. Honestly, DK. Yes. 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 Yes.
We have to make time and go and find these yeah. idiot things. Uh, uh, who what are you it? talking about? Look, what these kids are turning into is something else. And it's both the fault of we parents mm -hmm. and that of the school authority. That's right. Mm -hmm. So what about people, yeah. parents, thank you, parents who are living 20 states away from mm -hmm. here. They get, they get, you got to understand one then. We are the lawmakers in this country. And we must abide by the law. I'm not saying we should not abide by the law. What I'm saying is this. What about students who are self-sponsored, who don't have guardians, who don't have parents? People like us who went to school and in our old age and paid our fees ourselves without parents. Let somebody come and guarantee them. That way, whenever they want to do anything negative, they will think of that person they respect and who has stepped his honor for their ticket. Uh -huh. Not all these people are kids. Not all of them will go to the university to make trouble or to be irresponsible. Uh, look, my son is only a small boy. He's uh, 15 years old. He's joining them here at next uh, next week. Hmm? Mm -hmm. If not for the fact that I consider him too young, I would have allowed him to go abroad to study. <coughs> but look, my child has had the best of everything. Best home training, mm -hmm. attended the best private schools mm -hmm. in this country. He can't go anywhere, Miss B. No way! But that's what you pray would happen. But you have all this crazy influence from those other children who never had any sensible mission in the school in the first place. <laughs> and more, let me tell you, you see any of my children, any of those my children, right? if any of them misbehaves, I will personally rip that child apart. <laughs> When babies like you go to school, the parents have to come and sign behavior papers for them. I, Chief Okechuku Felonos DK, one-on-one -on -one of a Saba, hereby guarantees that my son, my baby, only 15-year-old son, poor Chidima DK, we're not really on his bed. <laughs> We're going to bed at 7.30 p.m. Tell you. Very funny. What says? You're jealous. Mm -hmm. You're simply jealous that we got admission to school at the same time. Oh, you at your wicked age of 18 and you at 15. Hello? Hello? Uh, please, it's uh, Gokeda. The VC, yeah, the VC. Oh, I see. Okay, listen, just tell him that uh, Chief DK called. That he should call me back tonight, uh, no matter how late. Uh, well, if he doesn't get me today, he can call me tomorrow. Okay, I'll be waiting for his call, huh? Thank you very much. Okay, bye. You see, the point is not whether or not uh, uh, parents are not responsible, but there are certain things you don't have to bother yourself. Mm. You understand? There is no... I can go and uh, do something for my child, but where is the time? Speak to the vice chancellor, please. <laughs> the G, G with the capital G. <laughs> what, what, what happened to you now? Eh? I called you yesterday, left my my number and everything, and I've been waiting for your call all day. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. What are you people turning our universities into now? Eh? <laughs> What is this new order about us uh, mm. to, to school to sign on that thinking for our children? Mm. So if you live in Sokoto, <laughs> oh. <laughs> so it's for sure. Mm. Uh, no, Goki, you know I don't have time to come and be signing any papers in the school now. Eh? I've been busy with this politics thing. Hmm? Madam. Uh, Madam is busy. You know she's been going around with me, introducing me to her own uh, connections. Uh, and well, she says she's been going out. Her uh, business has been suffering. In fact, as we are talking now, she's supposed to be going to uh, Singapore. When is the woman going to Singapore? She should leave it. Uh -huh. She's leaving tonight. 
Look, uh, okay, in our own days, we went to school without uh, help from our parents uh, mm -hmm. coming to sign anything. Eh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, let me send the boy to you. Eh? You, 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 you sign for him now. It's not every boy that will come to school and misbehave. Okay. Eh? He's your son. Come on, don't appeal to him. Don't appeal to Goke. He's a rascal. <laughs> Tell him that. <laughs> he Bald <laughs> professor. Uh, he's your son too now. Eh? Let me send him to you. Mm? I, will, I will send him with a card to you and uh, you, you, you guarantee him, please. Eh? <laughs> uh, let it be as you have said. Mm. Please. Eh? All right, look, uh, I have to run, okay? I have a meeting with the uh, Milad uh, in another 30 or so minutes. Yes, for sure, he's taking me there. Yeah. Okay then. Eh? So I will send uh, the boy with the card later today or tomorrow eh? to see you. All right. And uh, tell him to stay up those little girls. Yeah, man. Uh, nah. It's only logical I hit you with tactical techniques and methods that make you perform like Bruce Lee on the record. And yo, my status be the baddest, the highest. I be making niggas jump whenever I'm on the apparatus. I bring the world to his hand here. Yeah. As I make the panda rule, when I finish the people, make the world go round. I be the boy to move on with him like a nigga. And if you be down with my shit, then niggas gonna get your head. Y'all, niggas feel real good, y'all. Flip mode, it's hard in place, y'all. People who don't care, floss like a bunch of young black millionaires uh -huh. Making you run, me and my done, stacking my one Floss a little, invest up in the mutual fund Blowing your horn, a sense of every day it was gone And my mother will have a feet in my house and he party at this time You like, see the mask, make sure you're back on by 7 p.m. My man, this is the greatest time of my life Look, let's have a toast to A toast to freedom Yeah, my joy Afraid of us, this ain't a game to us. You strange, I can't smoke. Come on, and remember, federal ministry of health was a trap to smoke. Yeah, too much of us is dangerous. So dangerous, so dangerous. My lady, you find a great honor to have this dance. Hold your breath, we swing it from right to left. You know, you're kicking one of the most charming young men you ever know. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll take that as a compliment. Sir, I'll give up. Now, I'm going to have a dance. <laughs> Now, don't say that here. Come on. I want to teach you a dance of some classic here. I hold your hand and go. One, two, three, four. 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 One to three. One to three. One to three and go. And go. One to three. One to three. Well, I like what we have to do is teach me a circle. I know. Well, if you must know, I might be here like that for this place. So you lucky. You would have to put that looking for a husband. When I'm old enough, I'll give you the real privilege to marry me. So dangerous, so dangerous. My whole entire unit is dangerous. Come on. Who can you advise me to not be caught? 
more complex drama than my man I'm beginning You want to see me in the rock back I'm just done Three years old hip hop with more muscles than on the short time I was my little baby It's the only way you survive in this campus Tell me, uh, is that how you survived this place for a whole year? You'd be shocked that the immense benefits that automatically come your way. You've got protection. No lecturer will mess around with you without getting his fingers burnt. You have seen the girls on campus, haven't you? You can have any girl you want. Your security at all times is guaranteed. <laughs> Everybody needs a brother. Nami, you frighten me. You betray the trust your friends gave you to come here to learn. See, I don't need any stupid calls to survive my stay here. I'm smart, so I'll pass. See, I'll graduate with even a first class. Look, Chidi, it's easier said. The boys want you. And nobody. Nobody turns the brotherhood down. Or they make life hell for you. Now, listen, Lami. Go back and go and tell your friends that they've got the wrong guy. See, if anybody, if anybody at all messes around with me, first, I'll make sure the VC hears about it and that person and his called friends are screwed for life. The boys like you. I mean, they really do. They want you because you're naturally brilliant. You're constantly protected. Man, you will feel the real feel of power. Lami, Lami. When we grow old, there'll be enough time to get the real feel of power. This, this is a distraction. If you don't need it, I don't need it. I mean, can you imagine what my father would say if he finds I'm in a cult? Can you imagine? For God's sake, they specifically warned me about this kind of things. Look, all parents do that. It's a new generation. New ideas. They don't think they're going to change who you are. And for example, you can tell that your bimbo friend who lectures have practically frustrated her life on this campus. What do you mean? You mean you don't know? What? What are you talking about? Talk now. Well, a clique of lectures have been banging bimbo turns. They feel her whenever she refuses to cooperate with their sexual advances. She's had to put up with that for three years in this school, Chidi. She's not a happy girl. It's even rumored that she has been warned not to date students because she's their own. Can you imagine that kind of rubbish? But the poor girl had a guy to protect her. Those guys are doomed. Come on, Chidi. That's just a silly room. People tell all sorts of silly tales. Listen, Mimo. If anybody is messing your education up, I'm your friend. You can tell me. Now allow the VC do something about it. VC, Sha. I don't have any problems with anybody.
Why are you lying to me for God's sake? I'm your friend. You're like my sister for God's sake. I tell you, if this man is hassling you unfairly, then let's put him to the VC. This man is doing this to me. I'm not the only girl on campus. I'm just tired. I just want to go home. Maybe I, I, I just leave everything and go home. Oh God. What, what will they tell my parents? I mean, they'll be so disappointed, so heartbroken. How, how do I... How do I explain this to them? <laughs> and what is the board? And they've been working so hard to make sure I get an education. <laughs> how, how, how do I now go back and tell them? How do I tell them it's not possible? <laughs> how, how do I tell them? <laughs> You're right. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. Take it easy, baby. You're right. I'm oh. 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 so tired. I'm so tired. Just do what I want to do. I'm so tired. <laughs> There is so much sickening stuff going on around this campus and I'm not sure anybody's worrying about it. So it's taking you this long to see Abby? I reported the activities of Dr. Bert and his friends to the VC. Would you believe it? The man practically threw me out of his house. He warns that I must go and face my studies. That if anybody has such problems with the lecturer, they should report to the Senate. The whole VC. I mean, it's disturbing if the VC will take such a stand. Life on this campus isn't the most conducive place for learning. I have never seen so much pain, so much struggle at close range. Look, these rooms are overcrowded. And what is the stupid idea that it's only year one and year four students that get accommodation? What happens to year two and three students that school far away from home? Where do they stay? Students sleep in classrooms and in corridors. The facilities on campus are not sufficient for the load of students. I mean, why is the government not making arrangements to make better accommodation? This country is blessed with people and resources. I know one person is enough to do this thing, but, but no, they prefer to spend money on irrelevant things. And lecturers. Lecturers do anything they like, unchecked. I mean, it's very unfair. It, GD, why haven't your father donated a building? 
ว่านะฮะไอ้คนดาชีดี why man has got to chart the course of comfort he wants for himself while here long time like that one stupid lecturer was messing up my sister me and some of my friends also fixed him real good <laughs> real good First test of bravery is to rubbish the wickedness of that campus drag, Dr. Bright. You will break into his office and destroy all his valuables. You will leave him the message of his life. If he ever messes around with your friend, or bimbo, or any other girl on this campus, his family will pay for it, and so will his permanently charged dick. When you have done this successfully, you will do a second and final test. Then and then only will you be initiated into Brotherhood XG. Doctor Bright now, good to you. Oh man, 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 Doctor Bright now, he can't imagine it. The guy actually called me and apologized for all the things that he has done to me. I mean, it's so strange. Someone so powerful becoming so weak. Strange. You know the test that he gave us last week? I didn't have time to prepare for it. But the results came out this And you both believe I scored 40%. And I mean, can you imagine it? Me! 40%! I couldn't believe it. And what are you going to do with 
And then your mama said to cry. You want to be the fool, the mood I've given me. I will regard it, of course. I can find a Oh, yes, you know it's very far. You know you can't make it. I am truly grateful to Dr. Bright for giving me 40 percent. You aim quite low, and it's very sad. It's very sad. Look, I'll be disappointed in you if you don't graduate to the two. <laughs> <laughs> Chidi, you must think everyone is an academic genius like you. Everyone. <laughs> With the way that Sir Bright and his department friends have messed up my way, I'll be lucky if at the end of the day I don't have an extra semester or year and then graduate to the first class. Look, I'm just tired. I'm getting too old. Let me just pass it. I'm a nice young man and get it. <laughs> it's not amusing, Bimbola. It's not amusing. I mean, you owe a great result to yourself and your struggling parents to graduate with at least a second class upper. <laughs> Can't you do something? Maybe this evening's test. I just don't feel up to it. Look, let me put on you with You want to eat your cake and still have it? Brother, with XG, it doesn't leave room for test of strength waivers. You've got to stop being a small boy and take charge of your affairs, your life. But Don, what you want me to do is, is demean. We could get caught and that would be, be trouble for everybody. Man, young man, you're not worth having as our brother. You did an effective job on the first leg of your outing. Most of the girls on the campus are grateful for it. I wonder what the authorities will do when they know that the VC small boy is behind it all. How will the VC take it? How will your parents take it? How will it affect the political career of your father? The state governor has promised to get tough with any student cultures caught in the act. Have you ever been inside a Nigerian jail? Well, some of us have spent some nine months there. And I can assure you, we don't want to find out the details. And you better be warned that it is unheard of to tell on the activities of Brotherhood XG if you ever, ever do. We will sort you and the same goes for everyone you care for. We will sort your sister first in Uniben. Then we will sort that bimbo girl and your mom. And then you. The boys have concluded security arrangements for tonight's assignment. When you've made up your mind, I'll be in my room. even cover her with sand. The business people say our environment will last 
10 years. I am done with the assignment. Can we now just cover this grave and leave this place before we get into trouble? I wonder what the inside of this vault will look like. You should have gone to a line instead if you are that king. Let us go inside it. That is not part of the assignment. What's the big deal? We are already here anyway. Let's go inside it. Do you mind? It is my test of courage and it is done and over. And I am the shepherd supervising your test. What? What's all this nonsense now? Nobody said anything about going to this vault on campus. You don't step it in now. Others you do. Are you going to refuse? You guys want to steal from this dead man. Go ahead, please yourselves. But I'm not being a part of it. You fool, man.
Ah, 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 Look, listen, guys. We will just have to forgive Chidi for not meeting up. That boy is a real small butter boy. Small boy, my foot. SG boys must be strong. Respect orders and hierarchy. If we begin to keep the rules loose for some, especially because they are young and from rich homes, then the hood will soon fall apart. I will be coping with all sorts of idiots. Girls, we will have to apply wisdom in the matter, else the hood will be the one to lose. Chid is intelligent, he's likable, he's rich. His monthly allowance will be the salary of some people out there in buoyant banks. If we let him hang loose, all other hawks will grab him super fast. Support is not coming from the inside as regularly as it used to. We need his money. We need it. Then again, he knows a few of us. We don't want the beans spilled over the whole place. Do we? We initiate Chidi along with the other boys tomorrow night. X. G. 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 <laughs> Dr. Bai scored me 40%. Naughty man. Today, the man called me and once again apologized for all he has ever done. Good. Very good. And he had also converted the 40% to 80 overnight. Wow. <laughs> Miracles still happen. Should it be serious? You haven't been doing anything on my behalf. Have you? Me? <laughs> like what? Look, this man is pretty shaken by some people. And he told me to tell my friends to spare his family. <laughs> I mean, which one be my own? Eh? He also said he would ensure that I leave this school on shadow. And with a 2-1. Whoa, whoa, me, whoa. A 2-1. Wow. <laughs> splendid. <laughs> Very splendid. Chidi. You must know something about this. But of course I do. You just told me. 
Will you stop playing dumb? Will you stand in one place? Yeah, I'm in one place. You have to go and join the call, Tabi. Oh, come on, Bingo. That is ridiculous. And besides, no call to be willing to take little children to their brotherhood. Come on, Bingo. There's no need to link this great miracle of yours to cause him. We should be celebrating. See, you graduated to two one. You happy? Your parents are happy. I'm delighted. You will disappoint me if you've gone and involved yourself in the cult. So will I. You're too young for this thing. Those boys will only take advantage of you. And besides, I do not want to find myself in the middle of any lecture cult scandal. You know, even when you're worried, you're still beautiful. Cut off the scrap. Ah! Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Look, Bimbo. When I grow up, I'll give myself the total honor and rare privilege of marrying the most rare gem in the whole world. Chidi, you still haven't said anything. Shh. Ah! Jesus Christ. Ah, Jesus. Chidi, will you cut out the dramatics? I'm being serious here. Ah. It is very unfair for you to have given the fucking ring to that stupid boy. It was a show of courage, Gauz. The rest of us did the show of removing those things from their damned grave. Gauz, we will try and understand. It's fair we carry this duty boy along. I mean, don't let us get them and make him feel alienated. He will be getting the wrong signals. Let him get whatever signals he wants. Don't. With all due respect, you really are not carrying me along in my capacity as your deputy. I leave this campus for just four days and you take major decisions without recourse to me or to any other person? There are rules, but it seems to me like you are throwing them overboard. Goz, you are beginning to challenge my authority and I can't understand what all this force is about. For goodness sake, I allocated the share of the booty to you. Just, just you chill, man. Pam! I don't want, I don't want any of the stuff in the first place. I hate the way we came about them. I'm ashamed to have been part of that gig. Look, Lamy, I'm going to throw the goddamn ring away. What? You heard me. Look, 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 see, see, that would be a stupid waste. I mean, no, wait, okay, okay, see, wait, see. Then go sell their stuff and they end well for me. I man. don't need the stupid money. Okay. Show that you are smart. Sell the damn thing. Give, give some to God to cool his nerves. Don't need the rest to, 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 to the XG, you know? Finish. Look, let me. Honestly, see, I don't want to encourage the brotherhood oh. with more than my share of the annual Jews. Look, do exactly what I have just said. And I tell you, you'll become a hero in the XG. Okay, see, I'll even help you find out where they go sold their stuff. Sharp, sharp, no? Uh -uh. I came to this campus to get educated. All I am getting is stress. Unnecessary stress every day. I miss home. I miss my mom. Ah! 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 G, 
yo, yeah, nah. Who be the criminal, the one who keeps the blame The one who rocks remarkable, the one they call the real It's me, the ABO, UNT, undestructively Rolling like a 4-5 of Part 1, the part one Your girlfriend shorts and boots Well in the meantime, we got the shack man Down again, this isn't good, it's from the days back when Where we got the honey and hoes with the freaky toes Scrobos, it's a party, anything goes so Everybody let's have fun And since we know vampires, we're gonna book you from dusk till dawn From SL to Are you sure that that, um, dollars that that guy gave us in January? Well, I checked out that when better lights and streets is fucked up You know, we just turn around and, you know Dude, there's no harm in checking what God's got for his, uh, for his stuff. And to think that your ring was even smaller. You know, uh, cheesy. Now let me go figure out uh, 20% of it. Of course, when... <laughs> The monks is shouting This bad ass brother be giving props to niggas up in the house If you think you tough enough, let's take it to the floor My 44 will give you exactly what you're looking for Get off your high horse, nigga, ride You've got to be kidding me How can you possibly buy me a car? Look, because you treat me like your brother See, Bimbo, you're my best friend Happy birthday Chidi, I, I couldn't possibly accept a card gift from you. Oh, sorry. I couldn't afford a plane. Will you be serious? And where did you get the money from? How will I explain this on campus? Look, Bimbo, we don't owe anybody any explanations. See, an uncle my father doesn't like give me the money. I can't take it home and I really don't have any use for it. So I thought I'll buy you a grand gift for your birthday. I... I, I don't know what to say. Well, a simple thank you. was done. All this nonsense never happened. Oh, call yourself to order, Goz. You are talking to a don, for God's sake. You shut up! You are mismanaging the funds of the Brotherhood. You become authoritarian. You take vital decisions without consulting with your deputies. Nowadays, you even take decisions that are mostly unfair. You went and gave the most valuable ring to that stupid boy. The rest of us whose decision it was to get the stuff in the first place, you treat like sham? Don't. Don't. Treat the rest of us with some respect. Some of us are getting tired of all this nonsense. I am highly disappointed at you guys. I mean, we are here to discuss about the funeral of our brother, and here you are misbehaving. Don't you have any feelings? Living is about to die. We live and we die. There's no big deal about that. But let the living fight for justice. You are banished from the XG gods. Screw the SG. And you are banished from this campus. I leave the SG for you. But you are not in any position to banish me from this campus. You got yourself a war done. A major war!
is surely responsible for this. I didn't do it. Much as this guy was getting on my nerves, I never could have done this to him. No, God, you couldn't have done it. We were together all through the night. But the SD guys are holding us responsible for those men. This will set a major war for everybody. Who could have done this? Good God. I suspect the Bad Brotherhood. They never liked Dom. We must find out. Dawn's death must never be pinned on us. Never. Never. any brother. You guys were just a bunch of shit. I had to cope with this part. You fucking heartless. How about Daniel? You killed your friend. You killed your friend. You killed your friend. my dawn, you will be dead. And if you don't, get out of here now. I'll blow your fucking brains. Now. Get lost. Fucking damn it. Nobody. And I mean, nobody. There's me. Man, you know that. You bastard! Get back on campus before it gets dark. It doesn't make sense moving around after the dark on campus. At least not for now. These cold boys are insane. Imagine the reckless lives that they're living. They go through school denying themselves and everyone else of peace. It's unfair. 
Nami, I suspect that that foolish chidi boy has gone and involved himself in a cult. Things happen that make me suspect that he must be involved. Strangely, he never accepts or denies it. He parries talks whenever discussions go in that direction. Did you get to speak to him when you called this place? No. But the man that answered the phone said he was sleeping. So at least we know he's back from England. Yeah. I just hope he's better. Nah, Chidi's a fighter. He's not going to wallow in his ailment much longer. Besides, he's missed much of school. Strangely enough, I am happy that he's not presently on campus. The madness that these boys have unleashed on themselves. We don't even know which one is next. If Chidi is involved in a cult, I will personally report him to his parents. If that is the case, they should be drawing from school and send him abroad to continue his education. Can I ask you a question? What? You are in love with Chidi, aren't you? <laughs> uh, um, don't be ridiculous. I love Chidi with a passion. But the thing they have is a brother-sister relationship. He's a peculiarly special guy. It wasn't for the age gap. Believe me, no one will start that guy from here. He, he brings me joy always. He's my special baby any day. I can't wait to see him. to deserve this from this boy. Hmm? Dante, be cool now. Isn't there a way you can say this thing without any tragedy befalling this boy? Hmm. Auntie is your son too. Ijoma, Auntie, if I as much as open my mouth to tell, we lose this boy. That is what this person wants. She wants Chidi. We must fight to save this boy. But he has to lead the way. Chidi is no longer the small boy that left this house for the university. Mm -hmm. You people have to make him talk. Yes, who is this? Now listen, young man. Chidi is not feeling well. He is not in any position to come to answer the phone right now. Young man, are you listening to what I'm saying? What is so important that he cannot wait until tomorrow? I said I cannot call him to the phone. Let him answer the call. Hold on. Let him answer it. I should call Chi to answer the phone. Yes. Me. Well, it's not me that will carry this phone to meet Chidi, in the, that, that heartless son of, of, of your sister in, in his room. Chidi. 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 It's your call. Hello. Hello, Chile. Is that you? It's your maker. And see, may I please have some privacy for my call? Am I ex 
<laughs> exactly. It does sound good to me. Bimbo and Lani had a bad accident on their way to visit you this afternoon. Lani died on the spot. Bimbo has been rushed to a hospital. They, 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 they are charging the deposit of 20,000 naira. And we were able to raise only 4K. Can you help us raise the balance? <laughs> Rush back to the hospital. <laughs> Turn out the statue with me immediately. <laughs> Get the money across over. I'll get the money. <laughs> Just tell me where your hospital is. Where you they go now? Yo, may I go buy them for you now? May I go buy them for you? You don't look well to be walking the street. That's right. They are not for us say they come also. But which kind of important place this guy they go this evening? That's what concerns me. He concerns also. Thank you. 
situation to this. We must pray to be able to cajole him into a confession. Uh, uh, what is that stupid boy still doing on the phone? Huh? Here we are sit sitting and I'm getting worried about him and he's still there. In fact, he had better stop opening that his mouth now before I, 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 I slap him or, or, or do something terrible that I uh, regret. took something of our woman of faith. As in stealing? Who killed you? You stole from somebody? Hey, whoa! Did he? I didn't think I had to come and be. What kind of business is this? Listen. You people should allow this boy to talk. What, what is this? What is this? When you tell me, what does this child lack in this house? Please. Let him finish what he started saying. Now, what more absurdities can he come up with now? All right. This woman. Now, where, do, where does she live? What did you steal from her? She's dead. Oh, oh Lord. Lord. Did he? Did he say a step? You stop on somebody. I don't let him talk. No, 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 no. Are, are you hearing what Chicken Boy is saying? Chief, please just wait. Oh, 
I shall wait. Wait. Okay. I I'm listening. What? Okay. Oh. She was dead before I took her things. Oh, 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 dead! Ah! Ah! Chidi! You stole from the dead? Ah! This dead woman, where was she? It was at her grave. Oh, 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 I took her ring, her jewelries, her clothes and her shoes. Oh, I'm dead. I did. I did. I did. Don't, don't spray it on me, oh. Kodi! Kodi! Oh, my head. Kodi! Oh, my head. Oh, my head. Oh, my head. Oh,
not of love Let us give you back the ring that was Chidi's share. My special kind of ring. He reports to me. That was my wedding ring for my husband. Who died for me now. It was the only vital thing. He might be dreaming for life. Yes, now. You had the woman. You better set about getting her ring back for her. Kill him. Well, hand it over. Bring the ring so we can go and give it back to the woman. Are you dead? Where? Where is the diamond ring? Kill him. Where is the diamond ring? You want to take it easy. Now, Chidi, tell your father where the ring is. I sold it. Chidi! You did what? Ah! Chidi! Chidi, I scared you! What? 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 What kind of madness is this? What kind of disgrace is this? And tell me the person, tell us what you saw the ring to. Tell us where you lose your way and walks. Do you understand me? He was on contract with the construction company. He told us he believed in the country to the outside part of the ring. Oh, 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 it's, it's okay, it's okay. Okay, so what is the name of the construction company? I don't know. Ah, so, how are we supposed to choose this one? Maybe somebody had a joint mind. Ah, joint? Hey. Continue. Huh? Hey, joint? Our joint is not places where criminals sell drugs. Oh, Chidi. Chidi. Chidi, why Where did we go wrong now, Chidi? Tell me now, Cody. Where did we go wrong raising these children? What have we done to deserve this? Hmm? These same children that we labor night and day to, to make comfortable. <laughs> what is this? Did it why? Did it why now? How can a child from, from, from my house? A child from my house? Be going to places where criminals sell drugs, and if you tell me now, eh? and, and be robbing people in, in, in their graves. We will do the admonition later. <laughs> we have got a complex situation to attend to. Oh, <laughs> Oh, 
God, you are, you are, look at me now. Eh? Look, at, look at me. I, this is happening to me. It's okay. I'm supposed to be going to joints now. Fortunately, Major, but let it be as you have said it. It is, it is very complex. Halfway around the globe on an errand for a goat. <laughs> Man, I'm not going to be high. You shut up! You're the guy who's giving him too much money to smoke all this stuff. What well, now? He's selling his property to Tantra? Hey, you, 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 stop pointing your finger at me. That's the mark, calm down. This sneeze. No, what is wrong with you? No. What is wrong, what's wrong with you? You said that this is curious, no. Panicked. 